get a YouTube. So today we've got a HP power supply out of a, a switch mode power supply out of a um, HP HP Pro Lined G5 server. Now uh, I bought a server which I've got some videos to make. I've started making some videos to uh, make about uh, using as a um, altcoin, Bitcoin, whatever miner. Um, but I just wanted to talk a little bit about these awesome power supplies. Now they're hot swappable, so they've got this beautiful big, probably gold contact, and a couple of uh, smaller ones down this end. And it literally pushes straight in a carriage. It's got the ICE or whatever they call them. Connector there, really tight, really compact. And power delivery, let's have a look at that. So output 800 watts max. I think you can see that on the screen, yep. 12.15 volts, a little bit higher than your average power supply. 65 amps. Two volts at, uh, uh, two amps at five volts and uh, eight amps at three point. Three volts. So auto ranging input voltage, see so anything over 100 volts it'll run. And then we step up to, so that that's at 100 and that's 100-ish volts. So that's 100, 110. We're down here. Shit, sorry. 240 volts. 1000 watts max. 82 amps from 240 volts. And the thing's got two of these. And they both blow out warm air when the uh, server's running. There is no shortage of grunt. You've got these beautiful big fans. Let's see if you can see the pitch on the blades there. The blades on the fans are quite amazing. We're just going to pop the top off this one. Just to have a look inside for the sake of having a look inside. There's nothing wrong with it, it works. It's a, a backup for the uh, server itself. But. Uh, I imagine they're pretty damn reliable as it is, so we may not need it. We may even use it for uh, powering some external things. 12 volt power is something I do have a lot of. If you watch some of my other videos, you'll know uh, I've got a mixed, mixed bag of different kinds of batteries that uh, give me a heap of free power every day. Look at how tightly packed in that is. Look at that YouTube, that is a very tight space for all that action. Those little fans are really thick actually. I didn't think they would be that big. Really thick little fans that suck air through there like a rocket. Oh, that Transformers core is falling apart. Oh shit, that's no good. So that's all smashed. And yeah. So yeah, very minimal dust inside it. It's in good shape in that respect. A couple of really decent capacitors there. Handful of chokes, little transformer in the middle. Lots of aluminium. That's very cool. Nice fitting case, it's really, really fits together tight. It's all back together again. Does anyone know the actual pin out or uh, what contacts what on the end of that to make that fire up? Like I know you use the green and the black wire on your uh, standard plan old power supply. If anyone's familiar with the uh, power supply model, that'd just be interesting and handy to know because I actually have four of these so that's 320 amps at 12.15 volts 
potential I could have. I don't know what I want 320 amps for. I'm sure I could find a use for it, but uh, there's beautiful gold contacts on that board. I mean, I assume we got a positive and a negative for our 12 volt rail, considering most of it must be 12 volts. And we've also got our smaller ones down here, so something's got to activate it. If you're really familiar with the pin out, or you can uh, send me in the direction of someone who is, that'd be awesome, guys. But yeah, I just thought we'd have a look inside. I thought that's amazing. I thought it was only 65 amps. I didn't read the thing properly the first time I looked at it either. But now we now know it's uh, up to 82. They're really heavy, They're really solid, like a real serious power brick. But yeah, hot swappable. Managed to keep itself cool with thousand watts going through it and it's nice ball for reference and 12 Milwaukee shell oh that's a good one spray can lid only a small power supply thanks for watching guys hope you like the uh, quick look inside that hopefully it's something new you haven't seen before thanks again catch you in the next vid